Now, again, another big shocker. Let's go to his vocal reverb. His vocal reverb was a big shock to me. Why? He's got it on the A plate, two millisecond. Okay, that sounds fine, but look at this. This is the pre-delay, 152 milliseconds. Let me repeat that. 152 millisecond pre-delay on his vocal verb. I've never seen anyone have such a big pre-delay on their vocal reverb. And But you know what? It makes sense. Because again, what did I say? CLA's vocals you know, have a depth, but they're never washed out because he's not smothering the vocal right with the reverb. The reverb is actually almost a delayed verb. It's actually being used as a delay. Let's take a listen. This is our time. This is our dimension. All your good intentions don't mean nothing now. That is insane. It works so well. I'm hearing depth, and I'm not hearing this overly washed out sound. Uh, so let's solo all of his vocal effects and take a listen. 